Hi guys, it's Tuesday and I'm Danielle. And we're recording on my laptop this week because it might be better quality than my camera since it's kind of old and I'm still working out the kinks. Um, but along with this new adventure, we have some obstacles already. And since I'm on my laptop, I decided, oh, I'll just sit down this time. So I did. And then I get this lovely guy on my lap. This is my dog, Tuck. And he decided he wanted to uh, be on my lap for the entire video. So that's what he's going to be. Um, I wish I could gentle marble it and just put him in my shirt so he could be quiet. But he's a little too big to do that. So he's just going to be here. And this week we are talking about Halloween, whether it be past experiences or stories, like scary stories, or in my case, costumes, because I don't have very many Halloween stories to tell. So, let's get on this. Um, when I was younger, I was Pocahontas. I was a hula girl, like with the coconut bra and everything. Yeah, we still have that at my house. Um, I was also a ballerina riding a unicorn, and like my legs were the front two legs of the horse slash unicorn, and like my torso was the ballerina's torso, and then she had like little costume, had fake legs, and there's pictures of me in that get up at my house, which is down south, and I'm at school, so there's some pictures of that here. Um, uh, what else was I? Oh, in middle school, one year, I was a cheerleader, and then the next, I was a dead cheerleader. Um, in high school, uh, I didn't really plan on going trick-or-treating, but then when that Halloween came around, I was like, I want to go. So I put on my robe, some slippers, grabbed my teddy bear, and threw my hair up in a bun. And I went trick-or-treating like that with my brother, and people didn't really ask what I was, and I just got candy, so I was okay with it. Um, one time, oh, another, my last year of middle school, my neighbor made a costume, and it was like a tiger type thing, and I was going to a party, and so my mom spent probably an hour doing my makeup, and I got there, and I was so embarrassed, because it was, it was kind of awkward, and my, my costume's name was like an experiment gone wrong, and it just looked weird, and I was so embarrassed, and so I started crying, and then I told my mom I wanted to go home and change, and so I did. And I think I went as a cheerleader again. <laughs> I didn't really know what I did. Um, let's see. Oh, my senior year in high school, I went out with a bunch of my friends, and I was an Olympian. I got one of those cheapy Dollar Tree medals. I think I had, like, three of them. And I just put on a tracksuit, and I was an Olympian. <laughs> Great costume. Just for me. Um, my freshman year of college, I actually told my parents I was staying up here and just um, watching movies and stuff, but I actually went home and stayed at the weekend with some friends, and then on Halloween, since they knew my parents, they went trick-or-treating at my house, and I kind of snuck up behind them when they were going up to the front porch, and as they were hugging my mom, I kind of popped up, and then she screamed, and I screamed, and then we both started crying. Yeah. Anyway. Um, that's pretty much it for Halloween. I mean, I've always celebrated it. I've just never really done anything big for it. So, yeah. Um, this year, I am dressing Tuck up as a cowboy, and he has a hat and a vest and a fake gun, and it's, it's really cute. Um, as for me, I could either be, I'm thinking about being a cowgirl, dumb. Uh, or even Andy or the little girl from Toy Story 3. I haven't really decided. And so he would be Woody and then I could like go by a Buzz Lightyear and like have my, my toys. Um, I don't know yet. It might, uh, I actually just thought of something right now. So you'll see that tomorrow, uh, next week. You won't see it tomorrow. Um, so next week you'll be seeing my costume as I wear it. Um, yeah, that concludes my Halloween experiences over the years. Yeah, um, also, I'm so excited that you guys are going to VidCon, because guess what? I'm going to VidCon too! What, what? 
I bought my ticket, and I brought my brother a ticket, and I might buy my sister a ticket. I don't know yet. Shh, don't tell her. <laughs> but you would. Um, yeah, I'm going to VidCon, and I'm excited because I get to go home, because VidCon technically is only an hour away from my house, well, my parents' house. So, I'm so excited. And I actually get to um, be in it be at VidCon and not just read the tweets and see the videos and um I get to see my family which I'm more excited about but yeah I'm excited that you two will be there too and Alicia I am sad that you will not be but maybe when I possibly go to London to study abroad which may be a thing or not I don't know yet we can meet slash Maybe go to some in the city, depending on when uh, I go. Wink, wink. That was a really bad wink. It started out as a blink. So, that's everything I have for you guys today. Hope you enjoyed this not-so-cool video. Um, I will see you next week. And, TJ, I will see you tomorrow. I look forward to hearing all of your Halloween stories, because I know some of you have some really good ones. And, as always, DFTBA. We're stopping!